fam, it's your girl Gladys, aka Is That Your Hair, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm so happy to have you here. And if you've been rock with me for a minute, what's up, what's good, and welcome back. So today I have a brand new unit from Sensational. This is the Butter 2 unit. And today's video is special because I'm collaborating with my boo XOXO Sheba. I have been subscribed to Sheba for a while, probably like a few years now. I would like watch her videos, but I would say within this past probably nine months, I watched her videos more regularly. And I was like, oh, I really, I really like this girl. Like I could see us being friends in real life. <laughs> real life is in outside of YouTube, you know what I mean? I really stand for Sheba's channel. She's very knowledgeable, she's detailed, she's a little comical when she wants to be, and she's just really down to earth. Please, please, please check out my girl's channel. I will leave it in the description box down below. She is also reviewing this unit, and I'm sure she's gonna slay it. So see what she has to say after this video. Also, also, Sheba, I love your music choice, girl. You know, we both be on SoundCloud. Eh. <laughs> All right, y'all, let's get into this wig. Some of you may have seen my review on Butter One. If you haven't, definitely check that out. It'll be in the description box. Spoiler alert, I wasn't feeling Butter One. But I'm back with Butter Two to see what we're working with. Maybe Sensational redeemed themselves. I don't know. <laughs> let's get into the specs. So this is the Butter Lace 2 unit and it does come with your typical cap construction, your two combs in the front, a comb in the back with adjustable straps. This is a lace front wig, so there is lace to cut out the pack. However, with this unit, it is designed to me, it's very similar to Outre's Melted Hairline series because the front lays very flat, similar to how a frontal would lay. The main thing about this unit is the quote unquote virtually undetectable lace. We'll get into my thoughts on that in the review, but that's it's on the start card. It says it here, right there. I feel like that's a pretty big claim to say, but you know, that's sensational. <laughs> Let me give you a quick 360 of the unit. All right, y'all, let's get into my thoughts on this unit, starting with the pros. The first pro, absolutely for this unit is their lace. I don't know if I would go as far as to say virtually undetectable because I feel like you should only say that if like literally the lace melts right in without applying anything. Maybe in that case you can say virtually undetectable, but if you still have to do work to the lace, I just would not say virtually. We all see the marketing tactic sensational. Come on now. <laughs> Did it catch your attention? Cause it caught mine. I was like, virtually. <laughs> <laughs> okay, boo. But even though I don't agree with them using that term, I think the lace is nice. One thing I can say right now, I am wearing this wig glueless, meaning I'm not using any adhesive. I'm not using any got to be glue. I literally just applied my foundation that I normally use. And for those who've been asking and who may have missed it in the description box, it is CoverGirl True Blend Matte Foundation in the color D90 Espresso. That is what I've been using as late when I want to kind of blend my hairline, make it look natural. So the fact that I'm wearing this glueless is a big deal for me because I never wear wigs glueless unless it's like an afro. So I, I'm, not, I'm happy about that. When I inspected the lace, it did look thinner to me compared to like your average synthetic wig lace. So maybe that's why it's able to blend seamlessly like this, but it looks good. Again, I do think it's similar to Outre's Melted Hairline series. Maybe this is their response to Outre. I don't know. Another pro to this unit is that the cap is definitely big head friendly. I adjusted it to like the tightest setting because one, I knew I wanted to try to wear this glueless and that worked out for me just fine. The party space is also nice. It goes back, you know, a good five inches. And overall, I just love this top part, how flat it's laying. It looks really good. I really like it, you guys. As far as the styling, part of me wanted to say it was a pro because I like the layers, but another part of me is not sure. I guess the jury is still out on that, but I think it's cute enough. Now let's get into the con of this unit. My only con, y'all, are these fibers. You know, I should have known. I saw Shanice Nicole's review. She reviewed Butter 2 in a money piece color, and 
When she showed the ends of her hair, I was like, wow, wow, okay. But for some reason, I thought, you know what? Maybe it's because she has a color that the ends look that bad. Maybe in a number two, it'll be better. Well, here we are, y'all. I got the number two. And, and look at this. Look at this tragedy that I have in my hands. You guys have no idea the struggle I've been having with this hair just to make it look right and for the tangles to be tamed. Honestly, F it. The tangles, they're all here. With synthetic hair, you can definitely expect tangling, but straight out the pack, nah. Straight out the pack is just not acceptable to me. Come on now. What is this? I haven't been anywhere. I haven't been outside. I've just been here, sitting, still. <laughs> just trying to like do a few finger combing movements. That's it. And this is, this is what's been happening. So look, I could go on and on, but I'm not. But a two, you know, I, I love the lace, but these fibers have got to go. And I already had this conversation with you, Sensational. I already told you how I felt about some of the wet lace fibers. I think it's the quality of the hair. They should probably do like a human hair blend. Sensational, if you're watching, please do something about the fibers on your unit. You decide to bring that over here with butter lace? Nah, not feeling that. So yeah, I mean, I could cut, just cut this off and make my life easier. I could do that. Like if I just cut it to like right here, but I don't even, I don't even have the energy to use my scissors. Like, I'm just over it. And y'all know I like to cut. Y'all know I like to cut hair. <laughs> of course, I couldn't help myself. <laughs> right after I recorded this video, I cut her. And she was a lot more manageable. And also, there was an insane amount of shedding. This is the shedding I've gotten so far. Just from, like, raking through the wig. Why is it this much shedding? <laughs> y'all, what is happening? <laughs> Lord. I just can't. I'll say it one more time. Sensational, please work on giving us either more premium synthetic fiber or a human hair blend, please. With this wet lace, with the butter lace, with any lace, like, come on now. You have this lace that is melting so lovely into my skin when I tint it, but what's the point if your fibers are gonna be trash? Y'all, let me know how you feel about this wig and my thoughts in the comments down below. Have you tried butter too yet? If so, let me know what you think. As you can tell, I'm not, I really wanted to like this unit, but it just fell short in the texture and you already know how much that means to me. So I wouldn't purchase this. I wouldn't. If you're new to my channel, make sure you tap that subscribe button and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Also, make sure you check out my girl Sheba. Tell her that Gladys sent you. Tell her I said what's up. Hey girl, cause you're probably watching. <laughs> I'm so glad we got to collab together and I can't wait to see Sheba's thoughts cause you know, she keeps it real. She keeps it true and that's what we like around here. Also, if you wanna see some of my latest videos, check them out over here to the right of me. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.